morning everyone. I'm holding a chip. We are about to start a walk through the forest loop. No more Starbucks now. We got some lemonades and a bag of chips. And Whoa, we're just... what's that red thing? Somebody lost the ball it looks like. That's not anything natural. Yeah, I did a little work. I had a label and we were gonna do school, but I decided we should do our walk first because it could storm later. It's supposed to get really hot. Right now it's gorgeous. Let me see what the temperature is. I gotta set you down because I'm in walk mode. 82. It just, it feels so cool and nice, yeah. especially here in the shade. So we're doing this first. We're gonna stop in the grocery store because I haven't ordered groceries this week. I'm gonna get stuff for taco salads. That's what I'm craving. And yeah, oh, there's some raindrops. I guess it's just water in the trees. Yeah, we're gonna walk though. Hello, we are back. Got some laundry. Gonna carry it down. Right after we spoke, I brought up the radar. It wasn't raining, but a big storm was coming. Like, not a heavy one right now, but big cloud. So I was like, we need to take the short route. The forest loop is great. You can choose your size. Just like, not the super duper short, but the shortish one. And got to the grocery store. It had just enough time to get all the stuff we needed. And it was just starting to sprinkle. Raining a little harder when we got home, but yeah, we made it. Now I'm gonna start this laundry and we're gonna eat and do a little bit of school. And yeah. See what else we do. school we practiced reading our sight words some more read a little story together he's very good at sounding things out but he does not like to do it twice so it gets a little frustrating he's so smart though we'll get there he just needs confidence but while we we're doing that Danny was making bracelets he made me two new bracelets I'm over here because he's changing. 
looks like he is flossing. I'm just gonna show them my new bracelet. So the purple and the red in the middle there are two new bracelets for me. And then the others are ones that I really, really wear. I switched those out because they're bulky. I can only really wear one and I have to wear them when I have short sleeves on because otherwise the sleeves make them not fit. But apparently I can wear Sebastian's bracelets <laughs> and if Danny makes them just a tiny bit too big, like a half an inch too big, they're perfect for me. My wrist is the same size as Jack's as well as my hand. I just have tiny hands. But anyway, Danny was making this so he's popping up while we are doing school to try things on, both of us. What did we do after that? Hmm. And I did the laundry. I'm not sure what I did. Oh, we after school we went up briefly for a quiet time it was a really short one but Ziggy's just been so tired and he napped on the end of the bed the whole time we were up there like he usually will only stay up there for like 10 minutes but at least a half an hour then we went back down I read the news and then started in on dinner Danny cooked taco meat but I cooked it was just like an equal thing he made up a custom salad dressing. I chopped all the veggies and prepped things and we just made some nice taco salads and we had rice and corn. I had beans, chipotle beans on mine and they had taco meat and beans. Jax did not have taco salad. <laughs> He's not into that. He had a quesadilla and some corn and I made him a plain salad which he ate part of. I think he forced himself. And then I had a bath, I was feeling it, and yeah, then I put in a grocery order, though it's still being I, really I weird. Got everything ready. Okay, I'll be right there. The online grocery ordering is still being really weird, and you can't get any cheese. And now I realize the whole cookie aisle does not show up, like no Oreos, no Nabisco, nothing. If you search for cookies, the only results you'll get are the bakery cookies and the ones in like the foreign food aisles, so like imported cookies. It's really weird. I didn't really need them that bad, but I was like curious what the flavors of our Oreos were. Oreos do not exist. You get like an Oreo ice cream sandwich and that was the only result. <laughs> so weird, but anyway. I got that order in, so that'll come sandwich. tomorrow. She said they should, we get Oreos. <laughs> well, that's a little different. I can eat Oreos. They're vegan. Anyway, I'm just going to say goodnight. And, yeah, call it a day. Oh, I don't know if I've ever shown our FedEx guy who always comes to our house. He's like this buff dude. Comes running up with whatever heavy-ass box, like often our dog food and always grabs a, a few snacks. I, I keep it loaded when I know he's coming and in the summer I put a water bottle out for him because he always takes that. I didn't know he's coming because Danny orders the dog food so I didn't know FedEx was coming. And I see the truck pull up and I'm like, oh no, there's no water bottle out today. So I go bolting for the water bottles and he beats me up the steps. So I just go ahead and open the door. It's like, I'm so sorry, I forgot to put a water bottle out. And I just hand it to him. He like doesn't say a word. I don't know if I blindsided him, <laughs> but he's, he smiled, he was happy. And then I left the, the inner door open because I wanted Siki to get used to him because he barks so much at FedEx. I don't know, FedEx is like, his enemy number one, that truck has some sound that he hates, but having just the glass door, he was much better. And I pet him, I was like, that's your kibble. He just brought you your food, calm down <laughs> while he chose his, his treat. So that's a little story of how I ran with a water bottle to catch the delivery man. Anyway, let's say goodnight. Is midnight gonna say goodnight? Mm -hmm. All right, good night, friends, stay safe. Be kind and don't forget. Wash your hands. Wash your hands. <laughs>